My dear President and Father of the Nation, Muhammad Buhari, GCFR, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, I hope this message meets you well, sir. My name is Kanayo O. Kanayo. I'm an actor and a lawyer, and I hold the national honor of Member of the Order of the Federal Republic, MFR. So, on this occasion of my 60th birthday, I want to make an appeal to you as a son and a patriotic citizen whose industry contributes meaningfully to the nation's GDP. Mr. President, sir, this is not one of those appeals orchestrated by people to lend their voices. For it's common in our climb for people to urge celebrities and popular people to lend their voices to national issues or a growing concern. I am not lending a voice, sir. I am deeply pained by the loss of lives, wanton killings, and general insecurity in the land. The Southeast Geographical Zone is under siege. Someone may tell you it's what they brought unto themselves. As a son reporting to you, unofficially, every Monday is a sit at home. And every other day, Mazin and Kano is to appear in court. Your Excellency, Mr. President, the sit at home is very effective. Even government vehicles are off the road. Economic activities, sir, are paralyzed. Not good to be told otherwise, sir. The negative impact of this may be seen as only affecting the region. But Your Excellency, sir, it has a rippling effect on the entire nation's economy. Your Excellency, you are the father of the nation with numerous sons and daughters, including Mazen Nandekano. Sir, the buck stops at your table. I know and I appreciate that Nandekano's case is before the courts and you usually do not like to interfere with court cases. But at this stage of heightened tensions in our country, it is no longer enough to say that the matter is in court. You are the president with executive powers. My appeal, sir, Biko, release Mazen Nandekano. It's my 60th birthday appeal. Thank you, sir. And God bless you. And there were your excellency.